It's spring. The long, relatively colorless winter is giving way to flowers, trees, and allergies. Nature is reawakening in all her glory. Hockey season is winding down, and baseball season is launching, albeit without my beloved Cardinals so far this year. It's the annual time of change. Every major religion has its version of rebirth or reincarnation. Christians in their Bible, Muslims in their Koran, and Jews in the Torah. Even my accounting friends are experiencing the annual rebirth as tax season comes to an end. Amen to the U.S. tax code. It seems there's both a natural and a human cultural rhythm to slowing down, enduring dormancy, and then regenerating. And it seems this time of year works out for a great number of these systems. I have a question. Do I need to wait for Easter to be reborn? April 15th to be free of spreadsheet overload? Or May to view colorful gardens? Well, all of the religious reincarnations symbolize a spiritual reawakening. A time when we're supposed to take stock in our relationship with religious beliefs and strike a new deal. Wipe the slate clean and start over. Do it right this time. Nature's not so dictatorial. She just wipes the slate clean and makes it pretty again. On a fairly regular basis. But what about when we discover our midwinter ugly or our lack of spiritual confidence? We may become aware that how we're going about our lives is not how we want it to be. Low job satisfaction and engagement, maybe abusive social arena, or just not having any fun. As my friend Mary Laura would say, why not ask for a do-over? I'm a huge fan of pushing the reset button, asking my world for a do-over, and not waiting till Easter or the end of tax season or the spring flower explosion. I can do it anytime, anywhere, for any reason. So it is spring. Blossoms are blooming. Tax season is over. Easter was just last weekend. We're all good and fresh and new, reborn for the moment. Stuff happens. Things change. Sometimes our personal winter ugly can hit right in the middle of summer or this afternoon. We don't have to wait for next spring. We can ask for a do-over at any time from our world, our spouses, our kids, ourselves. Taking the bull by the horns and relaunching at will can spawn wonderful outcomes. That reset button is right in front of you. You can push it anytime. Now go out and enjoy the flowers. It's Kim, and this is another moment of clarity.